Escort County is set to move out of the purple tier starting tomorrow. The push to get more people vaccinated does continue. Health officials stating Tuesday morning that more than 230,000 doses of the vaccine have been given out in Kern County. But as 23BC's Kylie Walker finds out, they also acknowledge more work still needs to be done. As of Monday, Kern County has received more than 200,000 doses of the COVID-19 vaccines, with more than 11,000 expected to arrive by Tuesday night. But still, with these vaccine distributions this week, county public health officials are saying this number is low compared to previous weeks. The only thing that we can equate it to is that Johnson & Johnson has not been allocated for the past two weeks, and that accounted for 8,500 doses that week that we saw the largest amount of vaccine be allocated to Kern. Brent Kerrigan with the Public Health Department is referring to the week of March 8th, when the county's vaccine distribution reached its highest point with more than 30,000 doses. But last week, the distribution dropped to nearly 24,000 with no doses of Johnson & Johnson vaccines. However, this week, things have started to pick back up with an additional 1,000 doses of Johnson & Johnson given directly to a vaccine clinic at Bakersfield College that was held over the weekend. And more vaccine numbers were also provided in a Board of Supervisors meeting held Tuesday morning. Kerrigan says that more than 230,000 doses have been administered to Kern County residents and over 75,000 have completed their vaccination series, which is 8.2 of the population. And just under 100,000 doses have been administered to the 65 plus population, with more than 40,000 of them now fully vaccinated, which makes 37% of the population. But Kerrigan says at this rate, it will take much longer for specific populations to get vaccinated. It will take an additional eight weeks to completely vaccinate our 65 and older population at the 70% allotment currently required by the state. It will take 45 weeks to get the rest of our 16 and older population fully vaccinated. If the vaccine gets approved for those under 16 years of age, it will take 68 weeks to get our entire population vaccinated at this rate. And as of Tuesday, the Public Health Department is reporting that those who are currently eligible for vaccination include health workers, those in long-term care facilities, people who work in emergency services or food and agriculture, those 65 and up, or those with severe health conditions between the ages of 16 and 64. However, Supervisor David Couch has heard otherwise. But I'm hearing that lots of people that go in for a regular checkup or whatever that are not 65, have no underlying health conditions, are just asked, do you want the vaccine? And they're given it. However, Kerrigan says she's not heard of this, but for those who are eligible, an event this weekend is looking to boost those numbers. This weekend, we will launch vaccination information booths throughout Kern County. These booths will be located in areas frequently frequented by county residents. Bilingual nurses will staff these booths and can answer vaccine related questions for members of our community and help to dispel any myths. And if you'd like to see when you may become eligible for your COVID-19 vaccines, you can go to the website myturn.ca.gov. There you can enter in all of your information. Go to that drop down menu where it says Kern County, and then you could find out. In Bakersfield, I'm Kylie Walker, 23ABC, connecting you.